As the tomato diet gained popularity, ketchup sales skyrocketed, making Milton's brand ketchup the third most successful condiment of the century and most successful since Miracle Scoop in 1967. So when uh, we have a sentence like this, making something the third most successful and something else, we expect the two things that it is made to be parallel. Here we have the third most successful condiment, so we would expect the next thing to be the most successful since. So uh, we can get rid of the answer choices A, B, and E. Well, actually, E does have uh, the most successful, but it puts that after um, the uh, time phrase since Miracle Scoop of 1967. And it's not the Miracle Scoop of 1967. It was this other condiment in 1967. So E is terrible. Let's get rid of that. Uh, deciding between C and D, the most successful since Miracle Scoop in 1967, that correctly gives us a uh, time frame. D has the most successful after 1967, and then it just says Miracle Scoop after a comma. Normally, when you have some kind of noun, like a year, um, or any sort of noun, if you have one noun, a comma, and then a new noun, uh, the expectation is that you are somehow renaming the noun that you just had with a new one. There's no way that the year um, is then miracle scoop. So, um, so without, so choice D basically is nonsense. Um, we need to select choice C as the answer.